Hey guys, I've got a uh, ring finding job. Apparently this guy's uh, lost his silver ring while he was helping an elderly friend of his do some gardening. Uh, the job's in Napier, which is about um, three hours return drive from where I live, uh, in Taupo, New Zealand. So um, I've got to go down there anyway, so hopefully it won't take too much of my time. But anyway, um, I'll be using my new Garrett 80 Pro. Just uh, got this a little while ago. Uh, it's a great machine. And um, just getting my equipment ready for it. There's a little uh, sling setup that I made for my, um, for my metal detector. I've got a pouch attached to it so that uh, everything fits conveniently inside. Uh, one of my other videos that I uploaded, you can uh, see sort of in detail how it works. We just goes like this. Connect that to the base, and we're in business. Come on down, come on. This is where I've been working just recently, the last two or three hours, the first two or three hours, this is when the ring was lost. But this isn't even the start of the garden. It goes right down here, right down this path, and round this lattice work, down into what is out there, what an acre, acre and a half of absolutely dense bush. Beautiful magical area with lots and lots of statues and sculptures, but just hiding away one wee ring somewhere in there. Somewhere in there. Okay, come down this way here. All the rubbish that I had on that first morning's work was thrown over the edge here. So it's all on the right hand side that you're looking. The left hand side is the new rubbish. Spent about an hour and a half down in that uh, little valley there, little gully, and uh, there was just no go. Picked up all sorts of little bits of iron, and um, yeah, it's uh, it's a little bit uh, disheartening, but um, we're running out of light now, so um, we're going to have to call it a day and come back another time. And uh, we've still got quite a bit of area to cover, but um, uh, yeah, we've still got another day, and hopefully we find the ring. Okay, so um, it's been several weeks since I had the opportunity to go back to the address. Uh, the weather hasn't really been playing its part and we've been both busy, so uh, getting back there hasn't really been an option. So hopefully we'll have a bit of luck today. Um, the search was a lot more daunting than I expected. The area was very difficult to um, search and there was a lot of iron bits and pieces that have probably been there since the 1920s. And, um, did unearth some interesting pieces, uh, so hopefully uh, we won't have too much of that um, again today, and we'll find his ring um, fairly quickly. Well, 
close to two and a half hours and um, nothing. Same as the last place, just uh, bits of iron and steel and um, yeah, again, a little bit disappointing. But we've got one um, other place which is unlikely, but um, it's worth a try um, just before we call it a day. Um, if it was in there, I would have picked it up, but uh, yeah, there's nothing, so. All right, let's try the other place. Well, I didn't film uh, Kevin's reaction to finding the ring, but uh, we're up the top of the drive yeah, now. It's going to last uh, for a long, long time. I'm telling you, uh, whenever it goes away. <laughs> quite ecstatic. Yeah. So, just um, won't take that smile off my face, I'm yeah. telling you. Look <laughs> so, at that man. It's six weeks, seven weeks since it got lost, and I have never felt better in my life, oh, I tell you, you. Can you tell us a little bit of background to oh, why it's so important of the, to you? The, 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 why it's so important. Uh, my son and I exchanged rings. He uh, lived with me uh, from the age of three. We exchanged rings uh, for his 21st birthday. These rings are never to be taken off. Um, the rings mould was broken, was smashed, so that we would just keep these rings forever. Um, it's been on my, it's been on our hands for not nine years now. Uh, first hour of gardening, and this happens down down here. Um, I, 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 I'm, not often I'm lost for words, but I'm lost for words. Oh, Man, you're a legend. You're oh, a legend. No. I, I, I'm just never gonna forget oh, it's, you. It's, Fantastic. It's, 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 Thank you so much, Andy. Thank, thank you. you.